So why would you want to use Django from all the web frameworks that exist out there? So I think like one of the main reasons really is that Django is a Python web framework and Python is a great language to, to write because it's so easily understandable and so widely used. So maybe you already know some Python from doing data science or maybe you've just started your programming journey with Python because it's a great language to get started, but it's also a great language to keep developing in. And Django is one of those examples. Like you can build very, very stable web apps using Django. And let's look at a couple of points in more detail. So why Django is one reason is that there's a great community around Django. Lots and lots of people use the framework for lots and lots of different, of different websites. And there's support, community support, great docs. There's answers to questions. One of the reasons being also that it's been around for a very long time. Django was first released in 2005, so it's time and battle tested. There's lots and lots of people who have developed with it and who are using it in production web apps for a long time. So <laughs> that's uh, like two, two good reasons for using a framework also. Another reason is that it comes with batteries included. So what does batteries included mean? It essentially means that everything that you need already comes with the framework. And I believe the metaphor comes from if you buy like some battery powered toy that you can just like start playing without, without having to go and get some batteries. <laughs> so that's the idea behind it. And on the opposite spectrum of web frameworks, you would find something that's called micro frame frameworks uh, with Flask being the most uh, prominent one in the Python ecosystem. And those frameworks, they don't really uh, have all of the, they don't play all those bells and whistles that Django does, but instead you can think of them like a, a Lego base plate, maybe on top of which you can put different pieces and assemble your web framework in that way. So some people like this batteries included approach, some prefer the micro framework approach. It's a matter of taste, but I personally think that it's a good way to get started with batteries included because there's already so much going on when developing for the web, as I mentioned in the previous video, so that just having everything, all of these interactions cast into one form, into the Django form in this case, makes it easier because there's more or less just this one thing that you need to learn and you can still do a lot of tasks such as database interactions, for example. Additionally to all of the stuff that's already included in Django, there's a very rich third-party ecosystem. So lots and lots of packages that other people built that you can reuse. And what ties in with that is that there's pluggable apps. The structure of a Django project is that you can use different applications. We're going to talk about all of this much more. But just so you understand, you can build an app once and then you can reuse it in different projects or reuse the app that someone else built for you. And then there's the Django ORM. ORM stands for Object Relational Mapper. And don't worry about it right now. Just know that this exists. It, and it means that it allows you to interact with the database, any database, through very understandable Python syntax without needing to go into depth with a specific database language. You can just write Python and interact with the database. And as I mentioned at the beginning, one of my main reasons also why I like using it is that it is built in Python. And Python is just a great language, all around language for many use cases. Maybe you already know it, then it's a great way to extend the knowledge that you have in programming in general and add web development to the list of things you know. Or if you're getting started with web development and you know a bit of Python, just know that you learned this language and it's going to have a lot of use in a lot of different places.